work, energy and power. Work. It measures the effectiveness of force. That is, if force is applied on a body and displacement is occurred, then work is said to be done. Means, if there is no displacement by a force, means no work done is. Now, let one example. A mass M, a body kept on the plane, and a force F is applied on it. It displaces the body from A to B such that AB is equal to S. Now, work done is equal to F dot S or work done is equal to F into S cos theta or work done equal to F cos theta into S where F cos theta represent the component of force along the displacement. If theta is equal to 0, work is equal to F into S because cos 0 is 1, work done is positive. Case 2, if theta is equal to 90 degree, work done is equal to F into S cos 90, cos 90 is 0, means work done is 0, work done by this force is 0. That is, we have to say, if the angle between the force and the displacement is 90 degree, then work done by the force is 0, means work done by all vertical forces, always 0. Case 3, if theta is equal to 20 degree, cos 20 is equal to minus 1, work done equal to minus F into S, negative work done takes place by this force. Now, let dW be the small amount of work done by a force F to displace a body by a small displacement dS. Then work done is given by dW is equal to F dot dS. dW is equal to F dS cos theta. If theta is equal to 0, work done is equal to F into dS and the total work done is equal to integration of F into dS. Work done is also given by area of force displacement curve. If the curve of force versus displacement is given by this way, then the area of the curve includes on the displacement measure the work done by the body. Work done by variable force. dW is equal to F into dS. F mass into acceleration means m dV by dt dot dS. This is called work done. Integrate both sides. Work done is equal to half mv square minus half mv square means work done is equal to kinetic energy final minus kinetic energy initial means work done is equal to change in kinetic energy. This equation is also called work energy theorem. Application of such equation. Work done equal to final minus initial kinetic energy. If final velocity of a body is zero, means final kinetic energy of a body is zero, then work done is equal to half m into u square. F into s is equal to half m into u square. Let if the body is moving on a horizontal plane, then force F is equal to mu mg, which is called also friction force. That is, work done by the friction force is equal to mu mg into s is equal to half m into u square, and s is equal to u square upon 2 mu z. This equations or this relations generally use when a engine of a car is switched off on a road, then the distance travelled by car before coming to rest is given by s is equal to u square upon 2 mu into z. Second application of the same equation work done in a spring. A spring is example of a variable force, means in a spring force is equal to minus k into x. Negative sign indicate that f is always opposes the x. dw is equal to f into dx cos theta where theta is 180 degree means dw is equal to k into x dx integrate both sides. Work done is equal to half k into x square. This is the work done in a spring or work done by a variable force. Application third. We have work done is equal to change in energy means change in kinetic energy. If work done is positive, kinetic energy increases. If work done is negative, kinetic energy decreases. Now, we know that total energy of the system remains constant. Means, if kinetic energy is increases, potential energy must be decreases. Means, work done is also given, given as dW equal to dE minus d into u. Now, we have dW equal to f into dr. Means, force acting on the body is given by dW upon dr. 
dw can also written as de upon dr means f is equal to d by dr or f is equal to minus du by dr where u is a potential energy e is a kinetic energy and w is the work done this equation generally used to determine the condition for equilibrium or to determine the position when the body is in equilibrium energy it is defined as ability to perform the work basically energy of energy is of two types one is kinetic energy which is given by half mv square and another is potential energy which is given by mg into h total energy of a body is given by sum of kinetic energy and potential energy that is kinetic energy plus potential energy or half mv square plus mg into h now the relation between kinetic energy and linear momentum kinetic energy is given by p square upon 2 into m p is a linear momentum case 1 if 